Good morning, warriors. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Come on in the room. I see many of you are here. Go ahead and please begin to uh, hit that love button for me. Uh, please forgive me. I am a few minutes behind. So please forgive me this morning. Um, had some issues with the internet. But I am here in the presence of the Lord. Glory to God. So go ahead. Let's hit that uh, love button, that like button. Happy Friday. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning to everybody. Good morning. Let me see something here. What is going on? Oh, good. You can hear me. Praise the Lord. All right. Bless God. You can hear me. You can hear me. All right. All right. All right. All right. You can hear me. Good morning, everybody. Good morning. Bless the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. Bless the name of the Lord. Welcome uh, to Friday morning intercession uh, in the presence of the Lord. Glory to God. Hallelujah. 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 We bless God for you. Let's take this time to go ahead and hit that love button. It changes the algorithm with Facebook. We know that it sends out notifications to let others know that we are here in the presence of the Lord. Uh, go ahead and share. Those of you that have already shared the live, thank you so much for sharing. Let's go ahead and tag someone into the presence of the Lord this morning. Hallelujah. We bless God this morning. Uh, we bless God for life. We bless God for strength. Uh, we bless God that he has allowed us uh, to be in his presence. Uh, for those of that you know that are not on social media, our conference intercession line is set up. Um, that number is 605-313-4100. Um, the access code is 1872511. Uh, we are on that line right now. So if you know someone that uh, does not have social media, but want to be in prayer, want to be a part of, hallelujah, glory to God, hallelujah, hallelujah. We are here this morning. Uh, in the presence of the Lord. Uh, uh, so good morning to everybody. Didn't have everybody, didn't wasn't able to call everybody out by name this morning, but I love you. I appreciate you. God bless you. Thank you for being in the presence uh, of our Lord this morning. Glory to God. Hallelujah. 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 Bless the name of the Lord. We are excited to be here this morning. I am excited to be here this morning. There is so much uh, that's happening. Uh, I believe it was, um, I can't think of, uh, let me see, I should be able to pull it up really quick. I want to share this uh, with you this morning. I feel like this is important to share with you, uh, man of God, pastor, um, thank you little sis. Uh, thank you. Um, Pastor Lawrence Richardson said something yesterday that leaped in my spirit. Uh, he posted and I reposted, uh, the battlefield has shifted and moved the enemy. Um, the battlefield has shifted and moved. The enemy is warring on the minds of the people, the Lord's eagle. And this is so very true. And we've shared this um, a little bit. We have we have talked about this. And, um, you know, with so much happening, <clears throat> with so much happening going on, not only here in the States, but there was so much that is happening. We hear about what's happening in Afghanistan. We hear about what's happening in Haiti. And I know some people feel like, well, that's not here and that's not our responsibility. And uh, you hear so many different things. Listen, it could happen here at any given moment. Glory to God. It could happen here. The Bible is literally being fulfilled 
uh, the scripture is literally being fulfilled. Uh, we can go through scripture and see uh, what the word of the Lord uh, is saying. And so I want to encourage you this morning. Uh, yesterday, we were in several places uh, on yesterday. And today, I want to go to uh, Second Chronicles 7. I also want to go to Joel. Uh, Joel, the second chapter, verses 25. And the Lord has promised us, uh, people of God, this week uh, being a, a season of return. Uh, and I woke up this morning. Good morning, people of God. Good morning. Come on in. Good morning, Tyrania. Good morning, y'all. Um, uh, the Lord had made us promise this week that we are now in a season of return. And being in a season of return, people of God, we cannot... We cannot give up. We cannot. And uh, I don't know if you see it, if you perceive it. I'm sure that many of you do. Uh, how that there are so many uh, in the body that are just giving up, that are throwing in their hands, throwing in the towel, and um, uh, uh, in this season. And uh, and and it is up to us, according to the word of the Lord. It is up to us, the intercessors. This is the season of the intercessor. This is the call. This moment here is a call for intercession that God has called us to. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Uh, our answers right now are in prayer. Our answers right now are in intercession. Our answers right now are in uh, turning away. And turning to the Taradaraba Shuroko Rama Yandoro no Moya, Miki Andoro Shira, turning to the things of God. Hallelujah! 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 It is critical, and I can't stress it enough. I, I can't, I don't think I have the words to stress enough how critical, hallelujah, how critical it is right now. Glory to God that we turn our face to the Lord. Glory to hallelujah. Hallelujah. We've been talking about a new thing. We've been talking about uh, a new season. We've been talking about God doing, listen, God has already done what he said he would do. And now the season is, the season that we are in is a season where God says, listen, I am come for my word. Hallelujah. Those of you that were with us on yesterday, listen, if you weren't with us on yesterday, Go back and watch the replay. God said, I am come for my word. I am come to prove my word to my people. Hallelujah. But I am looking for a people. Glory to God. I am looking for a people that will seek me. I am looking for people that will serve me. Uh, the woman of God spoke the other day concerning a test. And, and when we look up that word test, that word test means to go. Um, uh, let, me, let me look that up real quick because I want to make sure I give you the correct definition. Of that word. That word test means the means by which the presence, the quality or genuineness of anything is determined. Listen, people of God, if it ever were a time that we were in a test, listen, the time is now. The time is now. It's a test. It's not an actual emergency. <laughs> it's a test. Glory to God. Hallelujah. And the test always comes to two. It is the means by which the presence the quality or the genuineness, glory to God, the genuineness of anything is determined. And right now, guess what, Brianna? We are in the test. The church is in the test. God's people are in the test. We are in the test. Our genuineness to God is in the test. And right now we're having to make a decision. Am I going to hold on to the word of God? Am I going to hold on to my faith? Am I going to hold on, glory to God, hallelujah, to the things that God has promised me and the things that God has said? It's easy to hold on 
uh, uh, when when everything is going good, it's easy to hold on. Listen, it was it was easy to hold on. We thought we went through something prior to 2019, going into 2020, until we were faced with this unseen enemy. Until God allowed pestilence, and yes, I said He allowed pestilence, and yes, I said He allowed pestilence, and yes, I said He allowed another double hoshia, and yes, I said He allowed pestilence until He allowed glory to God famine to hit the earth. He allowed glory to God the canker worm and and, and the grasshopper. He allowed it. There is nothing that takes God by surprise. There is nothing that takes Him. Uh. uh unaware. There is nothing that ambushes God. Hallelujah. There is no such thing as God being ambushed and he being taken by surprise. And so uh, uh, and God allowed this. Why? To get the attention of the church. Hallelujah. 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 And he is allowing it. Glory to God. He is allowing it. Hallelujah. He is allowing it. Hallelujah. To get the attention of the people of God, the word of the Lord. Let's let's go there real quick. Let's go there. Let's go there. Second Chronicles. Then we're going to go to Job. But I, I, I can't leave this. And, uh, and I know I was here yesterday, but I can't leave this. Glory to God. I can't leave this. Second Chronicles 7, uh, verses 12 through 14. Second Chronicles 7, 12 through through 14. Somebody needs to hear this. And I want you to go ahead and tag someone in this morning. Glory to God. Listen, the Lord's master of Oho, Rabashi and the Romo Korea, my Yandolo Lobo Boho Shatara Rabba Yandole Beke, Yashede Beki and the Robo Korama, my Yandolo Lobo Korea, my Yandelebe Shede, Mamma Mamma Shede Beki and the Roo, my God, Rashara. God said, my people are looking for a season of return, and I'm looking for no excuse. Oh, my God. Somebody type that right there. Somebody type that right there. Somebody type that right there. Somebody type that right there in the comment. Glory to God. Hallelujah. 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 He said, I am here to perform my word. God said, I am here for the return of my people. I've kept my part. I keep my part. I've sustained my part. But God said, I'm looking for people that are not making excuses. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And many of us, come on, people of God. Come on. Come on, people of God. Many of us, even in this season, we have made excuses not to be in the presence of God. We have made reason not to make God priority. We have made reason why we, we can't do this and we can't do that concerning the things of God. And the Lord said, I'm looking for people that's willing to obey me, to make sacrifice, to be in my presence, to seek me, to come after me. Glory to God. I am a jealous God and I will have no other gods before me. But yet we put everything before God. Hallelujah. We put every, we've seen it. Come on here. We have, we have seen it. We have seen it uh, when church was open. Uh, uh, and I, what I mean by that, I know that there are churches that are open. What I mean by that in the beginning, when everything was shut down, we heard excuses. Glory to God. Hallelujah. We heard excuses uh, even then where, you know, before, uh, church, well, I can't go because it's raining and I can't go because of this and I can't do this and I can't do that. And they just have to understand and da 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 da. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Mama, 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 shuro. Maki and the robo hosha. Maki, the robo ko, rashri and the robo. And so many other things took priority to the things of God. Hallelujah. And so he allowed this thing. Glory. He allowed it. He allowed it. He allowed it to get the attention of his people. And so, and even in that, even after, th excuse me, things were shut down and, and, and we came to a place where there was no more a, a physical gathering. We made excuses virtually. We made excuses virtually. Again, everything else was important. Again, we came up with excuses. Well, I can't do virtual. I don't like social media. I don't do this. I don't like, it just don't feel the same. It just don't look the same. It just don't seem the same. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. 
Come on, I, I, you know, I just, it's just not the set. It's just that, come on. And then and so many things are happening and yet we calling on God. God bless us. God help us. God do this for me. God, I want you to work a miracle. God, I want you to be instant. God, I want you to provide. God, I want you to, to, to bless my money. God, I want you to increase me. God, I want you to save my loved one. God, I want you to uh, deliver my children. God, and God said, I'm looking for you to hold up your part of the responsibility because I've already done mine. God said, I'm looking for you. I'm waiting on you. I'm waiting on you. Even in this season, God said, I'm looking for people. My God today. My God today. That's not going to hold on for five minutes. Not going to hold on for two seconds. Not going to hold on for an hour, a week. And then walk away from God and then and, 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 and get to a place of saying, well, he didn't do it yesterday, so he's not going to do it today. And I'm walking away. No, my God today, my God today, my God today. God said, I am not, I will not be prostituted. Oh, my God. Woo, my God. God said, I will not be prostituted. I will not be prostituted. I will not be prostituted. Come on here. Come on here. And we are in a season, people of God, where the people wants to prostitute God. I want you to give me. I want you to bless me. But I don't want to walk in disobedience. I don't want to walk in obedience. I, I want to do it my way. I, I want to have it my way. I want to come and go as I please. I, I don't want to be subject. I don't want to walk in obedience. I don't want. Come on here. My God, and God said, You can't, it will not work that way, it shall not work that way. I am still calling for people according to my word. And guess what, people of God, guess what, guess what, love, guess what, God will never go against His word to bless us, God will never move against His principles to bless us. I don't care who you think you are, I don't care what type of title you have in front of your name, I don't care what type of title you've given your mashro, I don't care what type of title you've given yourself come on here Woo, my god i don't care what type of title you've given yourself the lord said you've got to come by way of my word you've got to come by way of my listen there is so much in the atmosphere people of my oh there's so much in the atmosphere there is so much in the atmosphere my god there is so much in the atmosphere god has released god said i've done my part lord i wish i pray y'all hear me this morning i pray you hear me this morning god said i'm not a man that i should lie when i speak it i release it when i speak it i release it and it is so much that is right there in the atmosphere there's so much in the atmosphere and what has happened people of god two things have happened one is the enemy is the prince of the power of the air and so there is warfare in the atmosphere that is holding up my god the manifestation of, of the word of god uh that has come to be manifested in our lives but then the second thing that is happening is that we're not walking in a place to pull down in the atmosphere and, and do warfare come on we are in war who somebody type that please somebody type that somebody type that this is war this is war this is now we are not a patty cake patty cake baker's man come on we are not in 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 a place where the wheels on a bus go round and round come on we are not in a place where you know cocoa melon no we're not there we are in a place where this is war my god my god my god this is war this is war, and war is real. And when you are in war, Suriana, you don't take the time. When you are in war, you've got to be focused in war. Come on, anybody in war, you are focused in war. You don't go to war, you know, being distracted, got gum in your mouth, popping gum, chewing gum, doing it. No, when you are in war, you are focused. Why? Because your very life depends on it. And I hear the Lord say, i my Yandoro, she a little bit. My Yandoro, 
my God, my God. And I hear the spirit of God say, I hear the spirit of the Lord saying, listen, many of us are in war and we are in the war of our lives. Glory to God. And we've got to get focused. We have got to get focused. If we're not focused, guess what? God can speak it, but we not win the war because we're not in place. My God, my God, my God, my God. Somebody, who my God, somebody type in the comment. Come on, you got to be focused in war. 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 You got to remain focused in war. The time is out for playing people of God. I can't stress it enough. I can't stress it enough. The time is out for playing. We don't have time to play games. We don't have time to play hopscotch. We don't have time to be in one minute, out the next minute. We don't have time. Glory to God. Our lives are at stake. Our lives are at stake. The lives of our children are at stake. The lives of our loved ones are at stake. There, there are many of you that 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 even uh, uh, I may not publicly say things because of wisdom, but if the Lord is beckoning you in prayer, come on here. That there, there's some of you that I I look for. Many of all of you. <clears throat> But the Lord has shown me, even some of you, uh, uh, if the answer is in prayer, they got to be covered in prayer. They got to remain in intercession. They got to stop using every excuse but none not to be in the place where your safety is. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. People of God, can I share with you? And I, and I can share this and just close the book right here. Guess what? It's not over. It's not over. It's not over. COVID is not over. I'm telling you as a prophet of God, I know we want to hear it's over. It's not over. It's not over. It's not over. And it's not going to be over for a minute. You know why? Because God is still looking for people. He's still looking for people. God said, I'm still looking for people. If my people, where are my people? Where up? Uh, where is the church? Oh God! Oh God! Oh God! Where da 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 da? Shut up, da da da. Shut up, da da da. Yando da da da. Korea. Where is the church? 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 Come on here. We're doing everything but turning our plates down. We're doing everything but fasting. We're doing everything but praying. We're doing everything but seeking the face of God. Watch this. We're doing everything but walking in obedience to the things of God. And obedience is better than sacrifice. And listen, if you want, I'm going to say this. I'm going to say this. And I pray I don't lose some of y'all. But listen, if you want what God has for you, it's going to come with obedience. It's coming with obedience. It's coming with obedience. It's coming with obedience. You've got to obey the word and the will of God. You've got to obey. There's a shifting in the atmosphere that God is calling for. He said, beckon for my people. He that hath an ear, let him hear what the Spirit is saying to the church. Let him hear what the Spirit is saying to the church. He said, there is a people that I'm calling. There is a people that will hear my voice. Glory to God. Hallelujah. There is a people that will hear my voice. So many people are waiting for the old. I'm waiting for things to get back. I'm waiting for things to go back. Can I declare to you that there is no going back to? The old is gone. It is gone. It is gone. It is absolutely gone. And God is calling us. He's beckoning us. The heart of God. God said, I don't, I'm doing a return. Yes, this is a season of return. I'm doing a return. But all my people in place to get it. All my people in place to receive what I have for them. Look at this really quick, y'all. Just look at this really quick. And we're going into prayer. Second Chronicles. Second Chronicles 7. 12 through 14. It says, And the Lord said unto Solomon, and the Lord appeared to Solomon 
by night and said unto him, I have heard thy prayer and have chosen this place to myself for an house of sacrifice. I've chosen this place. I've heard your prayer and I have chosen this place. I've chosen this place, my God. I, do you know that there are not too many places right now in this season that God has chosen for his place? Do y'all realize that? Do y'all realize that? I'm not talking about going back uh, uh, to church as usual. I'm not talking, listen, we don't need a bunch of emotionalism anymore. We need the presence of God. We need leaders that are hearing the voice and the heart of God in this season. Come on, do, do we see what's happening? Do we see what's happening, people of God? Look at what's happening. Oh, that's just in Afghanistan. Are you serious right now? Are you serious right now? Watch this. He said, I've chosen this place for myself, for an house of sacrifice. If I shut up heaven that there be no rain, or if I command the locusts to devour the land, we see what's happening right now. Or if I send pestilence among my people. We know what that word pestilence means. We looked it up. We looked up that word pestilence. And I'm, I'm going to get it for you one more time because I want you to hear this. In case we missed it. In case we missed it, that word pestilence means a deadly, a deadly, yes, they are. Yes, they are. Yes, they are. A deadly or virulent epidemic disease. That's what pestilence is. A deadly or virulent or virulent epidemic disease come on here i remember the lord gave me a message about there are terrorists among us there are terrorists among us there are terroristic demons that have come into the church and this is why it is so hard for us as a church to come together because there are a terroristic demons that have been allowed, they've been allowed to come right into the church and have brought destruction and division in the midst of us right smack dab in the middle of war. Come out here. Come out here. Come out here. What do you think COVID is? It's a terroristic demon. It's something that have come to invade. It's something that have come to invade, to take over. And it's not being stopped. Why? Because God is still saying, where are my people? Where are the warriors? Where are the intercessors? Where are those that love? Come on here, somebody. And we can't get tired. We can't say, well, I prayed and ain't nothing happened. I pray no, 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 absolutely no. Absolutely no. Woman, you can't give up. Man, you can't give up. You cannot give up. Giving up is not an option. Come on here, somebody. Listen, God said, I have released. The Lord spoke to my spirit last night. He said, I've released the return. I've released the return. I have released the return. No, 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 no. 
He said, I have released the return. I wish some others were on here this morning. He said, I have released the return. Lita, he said, I have released the return. He said, it is up to my people now to get in place to receive it. He said, I'm looking for people that will move in obedience to me to receive the return. Listen, the return. Your re listen, the return right now. God said, I am come for my word. Come on, those of you that were here yesterday. He said, I am come for my word. But there must be an act of obedience from my people to receive the manifestation of the word of God. And what I have released, come on here, come on here. People of God, we have got to move in obedience. We have got to move in obedience. There are many of you that God is saying, separate yourself. There are many of you that you feel the beckoning of God. You know what God is saying to you. But because your flesh don't want to give it up, because your flesh don't want to let go, because your flesh, it's comfortable to your flesh. Come on here. You'll be ever learning, but never able to come into the knowledge of the truth. You'll be forever learning, but never able to walk into the prophetic manifestation of the word of God. Why? Because you're in and out and in and out. And what? I, one day I feel like a nut. Some, next time I don't. Come on here. Woo, my shurokura. He said, if I send pestilence among my people. If my people, which are called by my name, shall humble themselves and pray. Are y'all hearing this? The answer right now was an intercession and prayer. Shall humble themselves and pray and seek my faith and turn from their wicked ways. Then will I hear from heaven and will forgive their sin and will heal their land. I will heal their land. I will heal. I don't care what anybody says right now. Guess what? The answer to our healing is in turning. Oh, my God. My shoroboku. The answer to our healing is in turning. The answer to our healing is in turning. Listen, and I want to encourage you this morning. I want to encourage you this morning. I don't care what it looks like in the natural I don't care what it looks like in the physical. I don't care what's happening all around us. The word of God will stand forever. We are hearing so much stuff in this season. Uh, so many different analogies, so many different, uh, this about the vaccine, that about the vaccine. You take the, you don't take the vaccine. You do this, you don't. Oh my God. Can we just stop and hear God? Can we stop and hear what the Lord is instructing us to do as a people of God? God said, turn. That's what you do. You turn. Hear me. Hear me. Hear me. Listen to the prophetic voice, the spiritual prophetic voice, and then listen to the natural prophetic voice. Come on, y'all. So I want to encourage you this morning in the name of Jesus. God is calling us. He's calling us to a higher place of praise. Glory to God. And unfortunately, you know, there may be those that we love and know that may just choose to remain where they are. Woo, but you're in a place right now, people of God, we've got to get it for ourselves. And yes, no man left behind and, and we're not leaving anybody behind. But if you choose to stay behind, I cannot continue to pull you up. I cannot. And that does not mean I'm not praying for you. That does not mean I'm talking about mature people. I'm not talking about babes. I'm not talking about those that are struggling. I'm not talking about uh, uh, leaving anybody behind. Come on. If you want it, come get it. But God is requiring obedience. 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 Obedience 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 come on here we're putting everything in this season just look at it just look at the overall picture 
everything before God, everything, everything is priority. Everything is priority. I got to do this. I got to do that. I got to, I got to do that. 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 I, you know, I, I can't do that. I got to do that. I got to do that. And God is saying, I'm looking for people I'm looking for people that are willing to get what they need. I've released it in the atmosphere. I'm looking for people that are ready to get what I promised them through obedience, through obedience in the name of Jesus. And I don't, I don't feel in, I don't feel led right now to go any further. I feel like God has said what he's going to say. I wanted to go to Joel. I don't. I don't feel glad to go to Joel this morning. I feel glad to stop right there. Y'all allow me to, to. To I believe that when God speaks, He speaks, and then when I feel that virtue, you know, I believe in obeying the Spirit of God. But that's a beckoning this morning. That's a woe this morning. In the name of Jesus, please don't miss the season of return. Please don't miss this season of return. People of God, I beg of you, don't miss this season of return. Don't miss this season of return. The Lord said, I am come for my word. And I am come to return with the canker worm. The locust and the caterpillar have eaten up. I am come for my word. And we've got to be in place. We've got to be in place to receive what God has spoken to us in the name of Jesus. So, Father, I thank you this morning. I praise you this morning. I thank you for your word. I thank you, Father, that you have sanctified this place. As a, as, a, as, a, as a place of sacrifice for you. I thank you that your presence is here. I thank you that your anointing is here. I pray right now in the name of Jesus. Come on intercessors. I pray right now in the name of Jesus, God, that your spirit, Father, will come in and move in the midst of us. That your anointing will move in the midst of us in the name of Jesus. God, we thank you for your word. We thank you, Father, that this is a, a, our season of return. We thank you, Father, that uh, in this season, in the name of Jesus, that you have already released the word and that you have already spoken in the name of Jesus. I thank you, Father, in Jesus' name, God, that you have already performed your word and that you have already spoken your word from the heaven in the name of Jesus. Now, Father, we realize that the warfare has shifted in the atmosphere. We realize that the battleground now, God, consists uh, in the mind of the people of God. And Father, this morning, we come to tear down strongholds in the name of Jesus. We come, God, to cast down imaginations. Come on. Come on, warriors. Come on, intercessors. Come on, intercessors. I need to feel you praying. I need to feel you praying. Somebody, go, come on, hit that hard button in the name of Jesus. Father, we come this morning to tear down the strongholds of the enemy in the name of Jesus. We come right now, Father, in Jesus' name, taking authority over every satanic attack, over every terroristic demon, in the name of Jesus, every diabolical demon, got every illegal entrance of any spirit right now, in the name of Jesus. Father, we right now, we pray, God, for those that have been touched and affected by this unseen enemy called COVID. We pray, God, that in Jesus' name, that you will touch the mind, that you will touch the heart, that you will touch the bodies of your people. God, God, I pray right now in the name of Jesus that you will get the attention of your people in the name of Jesus. We cry out to you this morning. God, it is in you that we live, that we move, that we have our very being. We realize, Father, that we can't make it without you. We can't move without you. There is no us without you. We can't survive this season without you. God, if we don't have you in this season, we're going down. But Father, right now, by the authority of Jesus Christ, come on, warriors, come on. By the authority of above by the authority of Jesus Christ this morning, by the authority of Jesus Christ, we take authority right now in the name of Jesus. My God, we set ourselves in agreement with your word. We set ourselves right now, God, my God, and we say yes to your will, yes to your 
your way in the name of Jesus. My God, stir us up. Stir our mind up, oh God. In the name of Jesus, my God, the warfare has been shifted to the mind. And so, Father, cover our mind this morning. Cover the mind of our children. Cover the mind of our Gen Alphas, our Gen Zs, our millennials. In the name of Jesus, cover their mind this morning. In the name of Jesus, my God. Come on, come on, warriors. Come on, come on. Put that coffee down. Get up. Get up, get up, get up. I need to feel you praying this morning. We are walking in the presence of God. My God, we didn't come to be lazy. We are walking. Touch those that are not on the prayer line. Touch those that are not here, Father. In the name of Jesus, stir us up. Even the most, stir up our leaders. Stir up our leaders. Cover our leaders, oh God. Cover God, the fivefold ministry. My God, you are calling for leaders to lead in this season. Touch every apostle. So every prophet, every bishop, every pastor, every evangelist, every teacher in the name of Jesus, every pastor in Jesus that cover right now in the name of Jesus. My God, stir us, oh God, stir us, oh God, stir us, oh God, stir us, oh Savior, stir us, oh God, stir us, oh God, stir us, oh God, you said if my people, which are called by my name, here we are this morning, we're crying out to you, we're seeking you this morning, God, we're running after you. We're chasing after you. God, we're turning our ways. Oh my God, let there be a change, a change in our lives, a change in our hearts, a change, oh God. Heal right now. In the name of Jesus. Now, Father, we thank you for the return that you have already released in the atmosphere. We thank you, God. You've already released money. You've already released, God, income. You've already released, God, our finances. You've already released our children. God, you are already bringing a return, God, to everything that is owed to us. Father, you spoke to me and you said that you have already released a return. You said, now tell my people to go get their stuff. You said, tell my people to go get their stuff. And so this morning, Father, in the name of Jesus, my God, we are coming this morning, God, to get our stuff. We are coming, Father, my God, to get everything that you have for us in the name of Jesus. God, in the name of Jesus, we're coming, Father. We are taking authority in the name of Jesus, my God, my God, my God, my God, my God. And Father, we go into the third heaven right now. And we speak, God, to everything that you have released to us. We are commanding it right now to be loose. We are commanding it right now in the name of Jesus. You have already come for your word. And so, Father, this morning, we set ourselves in agreement with your word in the name of Jesus. We make a declaration this morning, God, that we will get in place. We will stay in place. We will walk in obedience. We will bring our flesh under subjection. We will bring our mind into one accord in the name of Jesus. And, Father, I thank you, God, for every person, every person that is on this live, those that got, that are watching via watch party, those, oh God, that are watching uh, via the replay, those, oh God, that are watching via YouTube, those, Father, that are, God, that are here on the conference line. I thank you this morning in the name of Jesus, God, that your word is finding us and the manifestation of your word is coming in our lives. In the name of Jesus, I thank you, God, in the name of Jesus, that the manifestation my God, that there are testimonies that are coming forth in the name of Jesus of what you've done and how you've done it. We will not be lax. We will not give up. We will not throw in the towel in the name of Jesus. Father, we come against, we take authority over the spirit of giving up, over the spirit of letting go, over the spirit, God, of saying, Father, that that is too hard. We come against depression in the name of Jesus. We come in the name of Jesus. We will not walk in depression. We will not. We pull on you this morning. You are our help, our strength, my God, in the name of Jesus. And Father, we bless you this morning. We bless you, God, for absolute. We thank Thank you for absolute God. Everything that you promised us. We bless you, God. My God, for the return 
in the name of Jesus. My God, everything that the canker worm, the caterpillar has, we thank you, Father, in the name of Jesus for the return in this season. In Jesus and everything that's been held up. My God, come on, warriors, everything, 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 everything. We thank you, God, for multiplying the income. We thank you for restoration of income. We thank you for restoration of businesses. We thank you, God, for restoration of our lives. We thank you for restoration of relationships. We thank you for restoration of our children. We thank you, God, that our children are coming back. Their minds are coming back. We thank you, Father, for healing in our bodies. We thank you this morning, Father, in the name of Jesus, that everything that seems to be lost through COVID, that you are returning. In the name of Jesus, I thank you, Father, for increase. I thank you for prophetic provision, supernatural provision in the lives of your people. In the name of Jesus, my God, and we declare that we will walk in obedience. We declare, Father, that we hear you. We declare in the name of Jesus that you are our God. You are our strength. You are our help. You are our redeemer. In the name of Jesus, and there is nothing, there is nothing, my God, there is nothing that we will put ahead of you. In the name of Jesus, we're finding our way back. We're finding our place back in you. In the name of Jesus. And Father, we bless you for it this morning. We honor you for it this morning. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. My God, my God, my God. And we pull down right now. My God, we pull down in the atmosphere. We pull down every stronghold every hindrance right now in the name of Jesus and my God we pull down your blessing in the name of Jesus father we reach out and we receive our return in Jesus name and so father we bless you for it in advance we thank you for it in advance we thank you that it is so we thank you that it is done we thank you father for restoration in the name of Jesus, my God, my yonder, in the name of Jesus, many of you, God is going to begin to speak to again in visions and in dreams. He's going to, God said, I'm going to stir up the gift back in you. Hallelujah. I'm going to begin to show you things that are to come. I'm going to make your discernment even the more keen in the name of Jesus. There is a shifting in the spirit. Oh my God. There is a shifting in the spirit. My God. There is a there is a there is a shifting in the there is a shifting in the spirit there is a shifting in the spirit and I hear the Lord saying people of God he said tell my people glory to God to get consistent to get consistent to get consistent my God to get consistent concerning the things of God to get consistent concerning the to get consistent my God you know where you've not been consistent. You know where you've been in and out and here and there. God said, get consistent. Hallelujah. Make room for me. Make room for me. Make room for me. Get consistent. Hallelujah. If you want to see my move, you want to see my power, you want to see my anointing. God said, I'm looking for consistency. My God, my God, my God, my God. Others may, but you may not. Others may, but you may not. Others may, but you may not. My God, there are many of you. God's going to call you in the middle of the day just to fall on your face and lie pecudios in the presence of God, seeking the face of God. God said, I'm preparing my people, those that are hearing me, those that are in tune or in line. He said, I'm preparing them for what is to come. Many of you guys been trying to get your attention before COVID hit your house, before COVID, come on, before COVID hit your family. That's why God was beckoning you to prayer. Before COVID, he got, nothing happens unaware, surprisingly to God. There are times that God comes to prepare us. Woo, my God. My shut He prepares us. For what is about to happen. He prepares us. My God, my God, my God. And we wonder why we feel the pulling. We wonder why we feel the beckoning. God said, get in place because I want to cover you. My Lord, emotional. I want to cover you. I want to cover you. Glory to God. I want to cover you. I want to cover you. I want to cover you. Don't move out from under the covering. Don't you move out from under the covering. Don't you move out from under the covering. In the name of Jesus, 
My God said it's not enough to show up in prayer and you got to walk in obedience. Oh my God, my God, my God, my God. Speak Holy Ghost of 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 God. I can hear, I hear chatter. I hear chatter and I can hear it in the spirit and I hear the backlash, the backlash. You know, don't nobody have time for all that. Don't nobody have time. You know, oh my God. Like, you know, I, I didn't know it was going, we we're going to be in prayer that long. I got other things to do. I, you know, I have work. I have this, I have that. You know, I can't, I can't make that sacrifice like that. I got to get my sleep. But And you hear the back, come on here, come on here, come on here, come on here, come on here. Stop it. The devil is a liar. The devil is a liar. You go out there. Glory to God, and something hits you, and then you want to call on God. God said, Come to me before it hits you. Ma, ma, do do bo sha, me ke do do bo, ma ma she de be ki an do do bo koria, me ki an do do bo ko rashra, me ke no 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 mo she an do do bo ko, ma ya an do do bo sha, me ki an do do bo bo she de de be be ke. Oh my God! Stop the chatter! Stop the chatter! Stop the chatter! God hears you. Ma da da ba ba sha, ma da da ba ba shi an do da ba ko ra ma sha da. Ma ko ra da ba ba shro. I can't make that. I can't do that. I can't do that. I can't. But the minute something hits your house, the minute COVID hits, the minute something hits, glory to God, you crying and, and losing your mind. And God said, I tried to prepare you for it, but you didn't have time for me. I, did, I tried to prepare you for it, but you didn't want to be bothered with me. I tried to warn you before it happened, but you were too busy for me. Ma, ma, sho, do, do, bo, shara. Me, ke, do, do, bo, shi, di, di, yan, do, do, bo, ko, ra, ba, ba, shara, ya. Ma, yan, do, 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 shara. Ye, my God. My, and I hear the Lord say, keep our babies. Keep our babies. Keep our newborns. Keep our, keep. I want y'all to hear me. Keep them under the blood. 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 Y'all better hear me. Keep them covered under the blood. Keep them covered under the blood. Listen, there are demonic forces that are walking the earth. I want you, Jesus, 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 Jesus. It is your responsibility to keep them covered under them. They cannot protect themselves. And there are demonic forces that are walking the earth. My God. There are demonic. Are y'all hearing me? See, some of us like to play with demons. I don't play with demons. Demons are real. Keep our babies covered under the blood. Stop putting your babies in contact with demonic spirit. Come on. Let your discernment. Listen, I don't care who it is. Oh, God, help us this morning. Help us this morning. Spirits are transferable. Sp are y'all here? Oh, my God. Spirits are transferable. Spirits are transferable. And you wonder why what's happening with your babies. And come on. Why? You put it in. Don't put. I don't care. Show my mama, yan do 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 bo ko ra. She me 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 ke do do bo bo she yan do do bo ko ya. In the name of you, no, you can't touch my baby. No, you can't touch my baby. You can't even see my baby. No, you can't. You can't. You can't. You cannot. I don't. I don't care. You can say I'm stuck up. Act. I don't care. No, you cannot. You cannot. You cannot. I got to protect my baby. My baby has no defense. I'm my baby's defense. Come on here, y'all. I'm. You can hear. Let him that hath an ear, let him hear what the Spirit is saying to the church. If you don't want to hear, then don't hear. Listen, we have babies. Babies that are dying from COVID. Babies that are fighting this demon. Babies. Infants. Come on here. Come on here. 
The enemy is coming after this generation now so that this generation won't have an opportunity to multiply. And you worry about somebody's feelings and what they're thinking. Girl, bye. Come on here now. The devil is a liar. You got to protect your children. To our infants, our, our newborns, our babies, our, our gen alphas, our gen alphas. They don't even know how to protect themselves. And you worrying about how what somebody going to think or how some girl by. Go sit down somewhere. Paint the blood over yourself in Jesus' name. We have got to... Our discernment, people of God, have got to become keen. Demons are walking the earth. And these demons that are walking the earth, are coming to snatch out who they can. But the devil is a liar. We plead the blood of our children. In the nanana shorokura. He, my God. My God, thank you for your blood. Thank you for your blood. Thank you for your blood. My God, I feel the release of the power of God this morning. Thank you for your blood. Thank you, Father, for rebuking sickness and death. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. Thank you for touching our babies, our children that are fighting this unseen enemy. Thank you, God. Thank you for sparing them in the name of Jesus. Thank you for touching your people in Afghanistan, Haiti. Have mercy in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. They're being killed for worshiping. And over here, we can't even find us in place to worship. Have mercy on us. In Jesus' name. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Father. Kishodomo Yanderebe, Yandoroko, Rababa Yanderebokuni, and Anamama Yandorobu. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. He that hath an ear, let him hear what the Spirit is saying to the church. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Listen, people of God, hear me this morning. Um, Glory to God. Hallelujah. 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 His presence is all that's needed. His presence is all that matters. Being in his presence is all that matters. Nothing else matters. No title. Nothing else matters. 
being in his presence. Hallelujah. Thank you, Father. I feel the presence of the Lord this morning. Just lift your hands just for 30 seconds and just give God worship. Give God worship. Thank you, Father. Thank you for pulling us back to you. Thank you for pulling us back to you. Thank you for pulling us back to you. In the name of Jesus, glory to God. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Listen, people of God, we've got to go. Listen, in the presence of the Lord, uh, tomorrow, those of you that are part of our second semester, um, Lisa Mackey Ministry Mentoring class, class starts tomorrow. I will be posting today. If you have not registered, registration is $25. We will be uh, tomorrow in the presence of the Lord. Uh, in Jesus' name. <clears throat> Listen, the Lord spoke to us this week. The Lord spoke to us this week. Um, and our seed, uh, a seed of return, actually started Sunday. Um, and I said this week that I will stay right here and obey the Spirit of God. And there are those of you this morning that you are here. We are seeding into our season of return. This is a special seed that the Lord has beckoned us this week. And I've seeded. Some of you have seeded. Some of you are seeding again. I'm seeding again. Others of you are seeding that have not seeded. <clears throat> I want you to obey the spirit of the Lord. Let's not eat our return. The Lord said, tell my people this week to sow a seed of return of $100. And when you give people of God, let me say this for those, for the backlashers, not that I have to justify anything, but when you see your money goes toward the working of ministry, uh, and God has blessed us to do a lot in this season as a virtual connection. So those of you this morning that are seating, um, I don't want to waste too much time those of you that are seating before anybody else logs off, I want you this morning just to type done in the comment. Type done. You say, woman of God, I'm seating. I'm obeying the spirit of the Lord. I'm seating for my children. I'm seating for my babies. I'm seating for my finances. I'm seating for my business. I'm seating because I'm rebuilding. I'm seating for my marriage. I'm seating this morning because I have so much in this season of return that I need God to do. I want you to obey God this morning. Hallelujah. Yes, Father, I hear you. There are at least nine people this morning that can do it. I heard the spirit of God speak. I'm not going to stay on it. I'm not going to harp on it. I want you to obey the spirit of the Lord this morning. Those of you that are obeying God with Pastor Lisa, I just want you to write done in the comment. Uh, the cash app is dollar sign promulgate, P R O. M-U-L-G-A-T-E. If you're given via Zell, the Zell is L-M-W ministries at email.com. Or you can go to the website, www.lisamackeyenterprises.com. And there is a link on there where you can seed uh, into the presence of the Lord. I want you to obey the spirit of God this morning. In Jesus' name, glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Father. Hallelujah. And I pray this morning that God will multiply. Father, every person that's making the sacrifice have made the sacrifice to seed. In obedience to you, I pray, Father, that you will multiply and give them double-double for their seed, for their sacrifice in the name of Jesus. I praise you that is done. I praise you in Jesus' name that it is so according to your word. I thank you, God, that we are seeding into our return. Yes, Father, I thank you that we are seeding into our return. Right now, I rebuke the voices of every witch and every warlock, every spirit of Jezebel, 
the power of influence. I rebuke you in the name of Jesus. I command you to hush your mouth in Jesus' name. I thank you, Father, for the obedience of your people right now in Jesus' name. If this time of sharing have been a blessing to you, thank you. Annie Kettles, thank you, uh, woman of God. Thank you for your obedience. If this time of sharing prayer, the word of God has been a blessing to your life, I want you to seed into the word of the Lord this morning in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Leticia. Thank you, love. There's some others of you this morning. Glory to God. I'm going to let it go. Hallelujah. But I could feel the static. So I know that the enemy is trying to um, uh, influence. But the devil is a liar. Don't allow the enemy to cause you to eat your seed this morning. For some of you, it may be a sacrifice. But I want you to obey the spirit of God. Some of you say, Pastor Lisa, I don't have it today, but I will give it. Some of you say, I don't have a hundred. I'm going to give what I can. I want you to obey the spirit of the Lord this morning in the name of Jesus. Again, um, the cash app is dollar sign promulgate. The Zell is LMW Ministries at email.com. Or you can go to the website at www.lisamackeyenterprises.com to sow your seed. <laughs> In Jesus' name. Thank you, Connie. Thank you, love. Uh, back to school seed. <clears throat> Thank you, Tawanda. Thank you, love. Back to school seed. There's some others of you. And I'm just going to release this out there in the spirit. Some of you are believing God for your businesses to grow, to multiply. Hallelujah. The Lord says seed. The Lord says seed in Jesus' name. And I'm just going to release that. In the name of Jesus, the Lord say seed in Jesus' name. Glory to God. Hallelujah. 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 My God. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Bless you, Jesus. There is such a Thank you for the release, Father. Thank you for the release. Thank you for the release. Thank you that the season of the times are not eating us up. No, it's not. Thank you, Father. Even as you said in Joel 2, in Joel, Father, you said that you will restore. I thank you. And you said that your people will praise your name. I thank you. Hallelujah. God, that we will praise your name. My God. Hallelujah. I thank you that we will praise your name. Thank you, co-pastor. I thank you that we will praise your name. Let me just, re I have to read this and I'm going to let you go, I promise. But please let me, please, please, please just let me read this. I have to. I have to. I have to, y'all. Please let me read this. I have to. I have to. I have to. And then I promise you, um, listen, <clears throat> listen. And I will restore you the years that the locusts had eaten, the canker worm and the caterpillar. This is Job 2, 25, 26. And the palmer worm, my great army, which I sent among you. <laughs> and ye shall eat in plenty, my God, and be satisfied and praise the name of the Lord your God that had dealt wondrously with you and my people shall never be ashamed. Whew. The word of the Lord is already blessed. God said, out of our obedience, I'm going to put a praise in your lip. And no matter what happens in the earth, my people will never be made ashamed. In Jesus' name, glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Listen, I got to let that go. 
Makura Bashiri. Na 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 na. All announcements are being posted to the Empowerment Survivors Facebook page. Please join the page. Stay connected for current information. If you're not a part of the page, please join uh, to stay connected for current information. We will be posting today um, for our classes and so forth. So please uh, be sure to uh, pay attention. And uh, I'm trying to flow. I'm trying to let y'all go at the same time, Sister Clarice. <laughs> Glory to God. Hallelujah. Bless the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. Bless the name of the Lord. Bless the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The presence of the Lord. I got to let y'all go. Hallelujah. Listen, praise Jesus. Uh, um, uh, please inbox. Uh, hallelujah. Uh, please inbox Pastor Nancy. Uh, hallelujah. Glory to God. Please uh, inbox uh, Pastor Nancy for information on registration with any prayer requests, questions, or concerns. Amen. Uh, if you have any prayer requests, no, Pastor Lisa is not untouchable. I'm not mystical, none of that type of stuff. Um, um, but I ask that you do that just so that I won't have anything to slip through the cracks in Jesus name. All right. Uh, we will be in class tomorrow. I'm excited about that. We have other things that are coming up. I will be posting and we will be back on Monday at 7 45 AM Eastern standard time. Right. Those of you that are with me with the Zeus, I will be going back tonight. We have not been on for a couple of weeks. Last week we were fasting. And so I didn't come on at all. Um, this week I needed strength. So I did not come on the early part of this week. Um, I'm, you know, but I want to keep consistent with that. So we will be on tonight. <clears throat> I will be posting about that in Jesus name. I love you, Sister Sherry. I love you, woman of God. I love you so much. Um, the blood of Jesus covers you. The protection of God gives you traveling mercies. Enjoy yourself um, where you are in Jesus' name. Amen. You deserve the rest. You deserve the rest. I love you so much. I love you, people of God. Thank you for your prayers. Thank you for your strength. Thank you for your love. Um, continue to encourage one another in Jesus' name. And continue to pray for Pastor Lisa, okay? I need your prayers, your strength, in Jesus' name, amen. All right, have a wonderful day. I love you uh, with the love of the Lord, and we will see you either tonight or tomorrow in class or Monday morning at 7.45 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. All right, love you. Bye-bye.